Well, hey there team, and welcome back to the channel, and welcome to Ravenous Devils. I thought I'd have a look at this. It seems to be on sale, which is interesting, because this game's already really cheap. Anyway, it's only a couple of dollars, so it's a couple of dollars less than that. Um, from what I understand, it knows exactly what it is. I haven't played it before. I missed it at full release, but we'll have a look at it now. Um, drawing on Sweeney Todd as a theme. Um, you know, killing people in your shop and cutting them up and putting them into food. And so it's sort of like a cooking management side on sim. Looks like it's got the sort of ant farm perspective of like an XCOM management or uh, uh, the uh, this war of mine. Oh my god, I'm sorry, stumbling over my words, but I couldn't get the words out. Um, so we're gonna have a bit of a look at it today and and see what it's all about. I feel like I'd like it. Endless mode, story mode. I mean, let's just go story mode. I barely slept while we were Jesus, on the train. Tom Waits is My narrating. thoughts kept me awake with a burning fever to see our new home. My wife Hildred and I decided to move suddenly. She hurriedly packed our luggage, taking only what was strictly necessary. We cut a good deal buying this place near the river, which had previously been owned by a well-known barber in the right. town. This house is surprisingly large. There's enough space on the ground floor to turn it into a beautiful oh, pub, while downstairs in the basement there's already a large cozy kitchen. I can't wait to get to know my new customers. I've always enjoyed watching people eating the meals I've cooked for them. <laughs> this lovingly. is so grim. <laughs> my husband, Percival, has cleaned the first floor and set his room up for business. A fancy tailor shop. Oh, it won't be long before we see the women from the local district showing off the beautiful outfits he has made for them. We are going to bring home the gold with our business. You may wonder what the secret behind our success is. Go on then, is. share it. Our loyal clients, obviously. Fantastic people. I feel kind of sorry about killing them. That's not exactly we sustainable. to use an unusual ingredient in our specialties. As a result of the insanely high meat prices, due to sheer hunger, or simply because it tastes so delicious, human flesh is highly appreciated. We do not know the reason why, and we don't really Fair enough. Care. It's my oh, kind of setup. Don't worry, we don't waste anything. Even their clothes are cleverly reused. Oh, there you go. They just need a little patching up, and then they are ready for sale again. At full price, of course. <laughs> we are working so damn hard to do <laughs> things right, and earn as much money as we right. can. Right, yeah, cool. Well, this would be interesting. I'd love to see how they tackle the idea that uh, if there's a dude that comes in and buys a suit every week, we probably shouldn't kill him. Uh, we're running out of meat fast. People in this town are like hungry dogs. At least this means that moving here was the right choice. We'll get rich. Not too fast, darling. We must keep a low profile <laughs> and work hard. You know all too well how much we are risking. Yes, I know. You don't have to keep repeating that. Throw this corpse down to the kitchen. I'll take care of it. All right, let's grab this poor wretch. Sooner or later, I'm going to end up breaking my back. I like management games in this kind of base perspective. This war of mine being the, the prominent one. I wish there was more like this. All right, so we're going to grab him. Oh, <laughs> that's a cool little animation. All right, in the bin you go, mate. Finally, fresh meat. The trap door is working brilliantly. It's time to stock up on some minced meat. The new meat grinder is great for larger prey. Let's grab the course. She seems to enjoy it a bit much, doesn't she? So what's going on here? We're chucking him in the meat grinder. Oh my god. Cohen Brothers would like a word with you. I clean this from time to time. <laughs> oh, that's rough. Uh, two? Only two? Oh my god, that dude was a big unit. I should take a look at my grandma's recipe book. I'll be able to add all my future recipes to it. Okay, uh, where's... Oh, here we go. Up here, right. Aha. Uh -huh. So what's this? Pie equals mince plus bloody flour? Salt? <laughs> mince and salt? There you go. I need flour and minced meat to make a delicious meat pie. I can already smell it cooking. Let's take one of the ingredients. Flour. So do we have like infinite flour? 
air? This music is so perfect for it. Like, it's so grim and awful, and it's just got cheery, lovely music. All set for cooking. I like the blood spurts out every time I click on anything. There's no tray here. Okay. Could fix these other two ovens, though we'd need more money for that. We'll work that out later. I think I accidentally skipped a dialogue. It glitched or something. Meat pies are looking golden brown. Time to take them out. Golden brown. That smells so All right. good. This dis the display stand is empty, so I'll place these meat pies on here. Aha. Uh -huh. So I can just scroll up. And then exit stage right. That's how we... That's how we level up or we'll go up. Alright, we're all set up. Oh, look at that. Delicious. wonder if my husband is ready too. He has to clean up the mess on the floor. Let's take a look. It's a bloodbath. I have to clean this place up. No one can come up here until there's no blood left on the floor. Let's get a mop and clean it up. Sounds good. Get on it, big dog. So he's got a little busy sign. This is pretty cool. I stole some clothes earlier. Well, is it theft when he's dead? The display mannequin is in exposition isn't dressed. I could patch up some of the stolen clothes and resell them at a steep price, of course. Waste not, want not, that's true. This may be a humble shop, but I'm a professional. Let's take the stolen cloth from that pile. Right, over to the sewing machine. It's not going very fast, but I can wait. Coordination and cooperation are the core of our business. I should adjust the timing of my work according to Hildred's needs. Clothes are finally ready. Put them on the mannequin. I like shop management games as well. Moonlighter comes to mind. Another 11-bit game. Everything seems to be set. Now we can welcome customers. Open the shop. Dear customers, please come inside. Take what you desire. It's lucky that I filled the display stand. Otherwise, they'd have been waiting while I was cooking. Every meal has a different price. I cannot give it away for free. I'll mark them differently from one another in the recipe book. They will pay a lot for my delicious meals. A pound 40. Oh, it seems like someone is looking for a new outfit. Oh, here we go. You never know if the work and style will be appreciated by everyone. Always keep in mind to do the best job that you can. We don't want bad reviews getting out. I have an appointment pretty soon. I need to take the client's measurements. Wait for the client to arrive. Hello? Oh, how much did I sell me vest for? Oh, here we go. Measurements, he says. Now we're alone. I can provide Hildred with some more meat. Oh, no. Oh! <laughs> oh, God. Jesus. I like the, the subtle knife on his arm. Let's take these clothes. Throw the corpse down the kitchen. In the bin you go, Shaz. Oh my god, this is this is so grim and I kind of love it. The music is perfectly chosen. More clients coming, we must be ready. I have to remind myself to clean up. Coordination's the key. Alright, so if I go clean up. Objectives. Clients killed. That's such a weird statement. It's a client. We should... Alright, hang on. So he's not busy. Right, she's in the meat grinder. Oh, hang on. Okay, so you can grab that and you can go sewing. Aha. Uh -huh. You can do that. That's cool that they sort of own their respective floors, right? I'm going to put the tray down. Recipes. Now, what's this? I can make a, a, a bun, a, a, a patty. Um, right, do I just put it there and then off we go? Baking time. There we go. Oh, better take some measurements. I need my hands free before doing that. <clears throat> oh shit. I've messed up. Moving there. Is that cooked? The oven is cooking. 
as fast as I can. Right. <laughs> okay, I gotta grab that. Gotta put on the mannequin. Okay, this is cool. It's a plate spinning simulator, you know? Oh no, she's cracking the sads. She's gonna give me a bad review. Spin that up. Measure this chick. Put her in the bin. <clears throat> yeah, I'm working on it. It's coming. <laughs> this is really good. All right. So I can only have one mannequin at a time by the look of it. It's really warm. Oh no, hang on. I hope I can't burn the meal. That would frustrate me. As fast as I can. Mate, just keep drilling these people. This is really good. Oh. Uh. There's blood ever. All right. All right. Go. Oh, complete objectives? Done. Ah, this is so, oh man, I really like it that, that it's a bit more plate spinnery. It's almost like a plate up sort of game, you know? Like, I guess the clock's gonna come into it. Starting over is never easy. There are a lot of improvements that need to be made. I've made 29 pound. Um, I wonder what that is in real money. I wrote this list of things we need to improve our business. This way we'll serve as many customers as possible with fancy shops. Let's see what we can improve. Upgrades? Woos. Report in the kitchen, workbench. Oh. Oh, I can buy more uh, recipes. 50 pounds. Unlock a table to make some steaks. Hang on. Unlock sus sausage stuffer. Let's do that. Oh no, I don't have enough pounds. Flour. Okay, okay, hang on. 20 pound. Here we go. Workbench. Unlock an additional workbench. Perfect. Oven speed. Meat grinder. Oh man, I am into this. In the greenhouse? Oh wow. Report. Reputation, bad orders, mixed orders, daily customers, skins, humble tailor, evil designer. Oh, okay, very cool. Gourmet chef. Does it come with the dog? Kitchen wall number. Oh, wow, we. Okay, cool. And then. And then. All oh, right, so we're closed at the moment. So, I need some meals to place here. Okay, hang on. So, two star. Right, so I was trying to balance my books, but honestly, that's not what we're about. I've got two workbench spots. Ah, oh, that's brilliant.
All right. So I don't think there's a reason to... I don't know if there's a reason to cook the meat patties up. No, 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 do this first. And then that. And then that. Alright. There's no tray there. Alright. There we go. Put him in the bin. Oh, hang on. There's nowhere to put it. Can I put it back on the bench? Aha. Uh -huh. Alright, this bloke, this dog's ready to go. Trays, three out of three. Ah, there we go. Three out of three. Ah. The display is full. Alright, well, let's just open the shop then. Can she put the tray there? Oh, yes. Very good. As fast as I good. Faster, faster, faster. All right, clock's ticking. This is great. Oh, here we go, here comes trouble. What's the geo with you? Yes, two pound, money well spent. Sorry, sir, sorry. It's really warm. All right, put this on there. I'll be with you shortly. Uh, here we go. Up we go there. Ah! Oh. <laughs> oh, okay, and the tray automatically goes back on there. I see. Wonderful. Oh my god. Has this got achievements or anything? I wonder. I don't think... Oh no, it does. Can't see my overlay, but just trust me on that one. Oh yes, my bad. Apologies. Right, you probably, you probably can't back up the corpses as well. Mate, they are going through the food like no one's business. Does anyone ever <laughs> leave my tailor? Oh, I guess yeah, they don't necessarily all come for measurements. There's blood everywhere. Closing time nearly. As fast as I can. Get that going. All right. Oh man, I'm flat out. Yeah, I know. I'm sorry. Now I just wait. She's angry. I'm clicking too much. I think we're good upstairs. Yeah, good. God, that sound is awful. Can she put, like, partial pies up? I wonder. As fast as Looks I like it. I wonder if it just acts as waste. So it's gone to three. Yeah, okay, it, it wastes. That's fine. Oh, look, he's taking measurements without stabbing him. 
Wonder what that's about. I might just let that play out, see what happens. Alright, so he leaves. We take measurements, he leaves. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. I hope all our clients were satisfied with our work. This way, word will spread from our shops. Reputation will improve. Hang on, did I skip something? That alone is not enough. We should probably buy some new work tools. I'm sure even well-known people will visit our shops then. Right. Good orders. Look at that. All good orders, mate. Look at the shop reputation flying. <sighs> you love to see it. Okay, 33 pound. Um, upgrades. What are we going to do here? I might just go down the list a bit. 35, 60, 20. Another workbench. Do I need another workbench? Fastest needle in the West. I could buy another mannequin. In the kitchen, in the tailor, in the pub. Tables, make yourself at home or another display. Uh, I feel like I could use another mannequin, to be honest. That sounds good to me. Males, I don't have any males. Oh my God, let's go. I want to play some more. Um. All right, he's fairly set. I might just open. The display is empty. Okay, fine. Oh, you know what? I've got the second mannequin. Moving there. <clears throat> oh, I, oh, it's the one in the front. Okay, I see. Yep. That voice, man. Bloody Michael Madsen stuff going on. A letter oh, arrived. Groovy. We moved here not long ago. No one should know us. I just it's we probably just a local this. council trying Did to get you, you to tell vote. Anyone about our departure. Silence. <laughs> Silence. <Let me> read. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> God. Someone knows oh, our no. secret. They probably know the taste of the pie. What does it say? Nothing good. Just threats. Apparently the sender knows us really well. Hmm, we have an admirer. We can't leave again. We spent everything we had on this building. I don't like the situation either, but I don't think he means trouble. Rather, he could be a rich client. He talks about a reward. I wouldn't just trust that. We haven't much choice. So what do we do now? Nothing. We just play his game. He'll get back to us. If what's written on the letter is true, we would risk our lives by leaving. He seems to be a powerful man in the city. Well then. Let's hope we'll get some money out of this. Never a dull day for us. I'll get back to work. Me too. This, dear aspiring writers, I understand that you're not actually gamers and you don't give a shit about us gamers and you're just using the, your writing in the games industry as a stepping stone to write your crappy Netflix or Disney drama, right? This is all we want for writing. It's sharp and to the point. It's minimal, right? You don't need to tell me about all the depressing things that happened to the, these dudes when they were 14 that made them bad. It doesn't have to be a huge bloody character study that tries to go 5D in its explanation. This is fine. This this is this is great. <laughs> this is all we want. Good gameplay with a touch of story, not the other way around. I get so sick of it being the other way around where gameplay becomes a vehicle for a shit story. Anyway. I thought I'd squeeze my rant in. Why does that? Oh, right. I've got the mail. Select a mail to read. Oh. I can read that. I'm not going to read it all here. Um, you can pause it and go and have a look. It's fine. Um, did I not open the shop? Oh, I suppose it paused me when I said open shop. All right, we'll, we'll play a little bit more. Good. I'm having too much fun. Yeah, I can't help but feel handled by a, you know, 
a modern writer. It would be a character study on what made these people bad. Or maybe they're not bad at all. Or, you know, this, that and the other. And No, they're just pricks that kill people and eat them. And it's a cool gameplay mechanic. And now their position's threatened by, uh, you know, an antagonist. Like this. Um... Here we go. Get shivved, loser. Right, give me your, give me your clothes. Okay, I guess I'll bin him. I'll bin him. This is great. There's, you could really go into the design principles here. Of the little canned animations. Uh oh. I thought he was coming in for a measure. Okay, so you can queue up. Queue up jobs, which is great. As fast as I can. <clears throat> okay. Go away. Uh, <clears throat> to a point, you can... You can queue it up. To a point. Man, this this just has come along at the right time for me. Sorry, mate, I need your cloth. Whoops, I misclicked, sorry. I can. The little the little indications are really handy as well. Ready to Struggling to keep up with demand. Shit. She's gonna give me a bad review. Buy it. I like this yeah, I like the colour too. Buy it, buy it, buy it, Sharon. Better feed this dude some meat. Man's getting gnashy. Oh no. Alright, last clients. I can do this in time, I reckon. Baking time. <clears throat> Moving. Maybe. There. Big maybe. Oh, come on, lad. Oh, I don't know. I think maybe she's gonna walk out. There's blood everywhere. Moving there. Mate, I'm going through the meat like crazy. I should clean this from time <laughs> to time. Maybe. <gasps> no. 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 <laughs> this is a massive. Well, if you say so. Reputation loss. Ah. All right. Oh, look at that. Bad order minus thirty. Three good orders is. Well, mixed orders. Right, so if you drop the ball, you really uh you really pay for it. 
Interesting. 30 pound. What can we do with that? I can cook more. Um, oven speed. I might actually just... Well, hang on. In the tailor. Stolen clothes. Gets an additional piece of cloth. Oh, yes. Yes. All right, so we need to make a mental note of our bottlenecks as we go. I don't think 10 pound is going to do me anything. But that's okay. Very cool. Well, there you go. Ravenous Devils. What an absolute banger. It puts games to shame. Like I said, we've got this AAA plus category... I'm using for my naming conventions, which is to say there are games now, two that have come across my desk recently, that cost 120 Australian, when 90 is the usual AAA price. And this thing I'm pretty sure I picked up for $2. And uh, uh, I'll say it, I'm enjoying it more than Starfield, you know? <laughs> at least when at least when you hang the dollar amount over my head. Um, so that's pretty wild. Anyway, but, you know, each to their own. It's your money. Spend it how you will. But this is an absolute steal. You should check it out yourself. Team, we might just leave it there for the time being, and I will catch you guys on the next one.